With the latest version of the Single Fire Cloud, you now can create dashboards. Dashboards allow you to combine and aggregate measurements from multiple rangers onto one single screen. To create one, simply click on Manage Dashboards. Then click Add a Dashboard. Rename the dashboard to something that relates to your application. Then to add a data point, you must first create a data group. So data groups allow you to combine measurements in a logical way. So say the first thing you would like to uh, monitor for this tank farm is the level of a tank. So I'm going to create a data group that I will call level. And then I can add a data point by simply selecting from the drop-down list the measurement from a ranger. So I'm going to grab a ranger here. And from that ranger, we have multiple metrics available to select from. In this case, I have already have a level programmed or set up in that ranger. And I would like to display on my dashboard this level using a 10 gauge. And I'm going to save. Let's add another data point. I'm going to go select the ranger, um, like a different ranger. Uh, say I grab uh, my Tim's ranger and well number two from such ranger. And I'd like to display as well using a 10 gauge. And I'm going to go get another one. So let's grab another ranger somewhere else. Um, and display that again as a 10 gauge. And I could go on and on and on. So this data group called level includes the metrics from different rangers that I will display using a 10 gauge. Let's go back to the group selection now. Within the dashboard called tank farm, I'm also interested in monitoring the health of my rangers. And so I'm going to add another data group. And this data group, I will name it Ranger Node Health. Let's add some data points. Click Add a Data Point. I will select, say, from the same rangers. Uh, in this case, what will be useful is, uh, say I would be interested in the uh, Ranger battery voltage. And I would like to display that as a dial gauge. And I will add again from the, uh, the one I selected before, Tim's Ranger, the battery voltage, and a dial gauge. By the way, I could have done also bulk add data points and then select from multiple rangers one single metric or a common metric amongst different rangers. So say if I click bulk add, well here if I go and select the different the same rangers, the uh, uh, Russell's ranger, battery voltage. And I could pick like here, dial gauge and so forth. So this is another way of doing it by selecting multiple rangers in a common metric across all these rangers. And that would be just another way of doing it. Now let me click add a data point. I think I had another one and grab the uh, ranger voltage, a dial gauge, save. Now let's go to the group selection, go back to the dashboard selection. We now have the tank farm. There's two day groups. And in order to view them or view the dashboard, I can go back and click on dashboards, uh, click on view here. By clicking this arrow, I will now have a visual 
of the dashboard I just created. So I have the group called Level, monitoring my tanks. I have a group called Ranger Node Health, monitoring the battery voltage of my Rangers. So it's that easy. This is how you create a dashboard with the Signal Fire Cloud.